Thank you for joining us at five tonight. There are finally some decisions on the future of the Minneapolis precincts or police departments. Third precinct, I should say. Kaya Edwards has the details that were just approved by the city council. Kaya. Hi, Rena. Today, council passed two items, one to do with what cannot become of the damaged third precinct building, the other with where to move officers until a decision on a permanent location is made. By uh, President Jenkins. Aye. There are 13 eyes. Minneapolis City Council has unanimously approved President Andrea Jenkins legislative directive related to relocating third precinct officers. First precinct officers currently in a different downtown building would move into the vacant Century Plaza building next summer, followed by third precinct officers temporarily moving into the same building by the end of next year. Jenkins says the mayor and staff will be looking into this and are expected to report back by September. It comes days after a community engagement survey showed neighbors want a more nuanced set of options. Rather than placing officers back at the site where the third precinct building burned over three years ago, or building on empty land some blocks away. I'm so proud of the community for rejecting both and allowing um, our leadership to come forward with another option, a third option now. Council also approved eliminating the damaged third precinct site from ever being considered a police precinct or a place to hold police functions again. This will help ease the concerns that many of my constituents have and it will allow them to begin to heal. Just the thought of it, of returning officers to that building makes me queasy. I've also talked to police officers who say they don't want to go back to that space. Vice President Linnea Palmisano. I really want to sink into this report a little bit more. Was the only one who voted no. The action to eliminate um, any sort of MPD presence forever from one of our city buildings um, it, forever uh, seems to really fly directly in the face of this report and not complement this report or where we are at. Still undecided is whether 3rd Precinct Police will eventually move back to the 3rd Precinct area, putting them closer to calls for service. All right, thank you, Kaya.